something like now what is the stage people are and how most have people been working on this side so far okay thank you very much my name is Afolai David Shagri, civil engineer I'm the project manager of the company Ferrotex Construction Company and the road we are standing on is Shalom Road which is a 560 meter road then adjacent to this road is the Umimo Road which is about one kilometer 30 meters in total giving us uh, the length of 1,590 meters of road here. Yeah. And um, before now, this place was very, very impossible. You can uh, ask the people living around. There used to be a kind of uh, waterlogged section here, yeah, whereby vehicles cannot even plan. Yeah. So uh, the Abia State government deemed it fit to at least give succor to the people staying here. And uh, we were called upon, because of our track record, to come and uh, fix the road. Uh, with this road, we started construction process at about two months ago, and uh, you can see we are on the wearing course. Uh, the design given to us from the State Minister of Works, uh, with the help of the Honorable Commissioner, we have uh, a road sitting on the, a subgrade of sharp sand. Then um, we have uh, a base course of stone base. Then we have a binder course and a wearing course. So presently now what you see us doing now is the wearing course of the road. So that is what we are doing. And um, in the construction process, there was no, there was no hiccup aside the rain, which is a natural uh, uh, phenomenon. Every other thing, the community people, they were welcoming, they welcomed us uh, at least we had no problem from them so and uh, that is why we were able to deliver at this fast rate if not for the rain we would have even by now finished uh, the road but uh, more or less in the next two weeks we'll be done with the total section of the road uh, like uh, just like i asked him now i know we actually talks about durability, not just constructing and also fast delivery, but deliberately matters a lot because more good work, they say a gratis more work. So what are the people expecting in terms of the durability of this road now? Okay, there's something I want to say. Mm, using a subgrade of sharp sand. Sharp sand uh, is a material that uh, can stand um, that can stand the how will I put it now? It's not affected by water, unlike laterite. Okay. You know, when you use uh, laterite, uh, because of the bulking, that's when water gets into laterite, it bulks, and during, when it dries, it shrinks, and uh, before you know you might start having crack. And uh, the kind of laterite you get around this area is not that good type of laterite, so it's better using sharp sand. So we were instructed to make use of sharp sand as our subgrade. So with that, with the sub, with the star base course, which is the stone base of 150 mm, then the binder course and the wearing course, I can guarantee a minimum year of 20. Wow. Yeah. So the people of this particular residence can actually enjoy the smooth zone and they yeah. nice for 20 years. Very, very well. And uh, you can see the drainage system. Yeah, it really Once the rain falls, the water goes. You won't see a drop of water because we were able to get a very good channel at the uh, toe end of the road. So once rain falls, it goes. And uh, the problem with roads majorly is rain, water mainly. Once water don't have areas to go, it definitely affects the road. So but with what we've done, I can guarantee that. Now, the defense of uh, usage now is any vehicle at all. Actually yes, yes. Now, yes, yes, yes. Any vehicle. No matter, no matter the wheel load, it will carry it. Yes, it will carry it. Thank you very much.